everybody! Welcome back to Bubble Pop Kids! We have a fun show today with tons of different things. How about some pop outs? We have an MLP little pop out set, and it comes with Twilight Sparkle and Pinkie Pie. Little pop outs are the cutest. They're like these little cardboard cutouts, and you can color them. They can stand up. They're like little decorations. It comes with four crayons, all the perfect colors. And to add a little fun, we have eight wacky scented markers. We have these crazy art, crazy face markers. They have the yummiest scents like chocolate and bubble gum. Let's do a little color in with those. How about some lip balm? I can't do a video without it and these are adorable. Look at this little orange slice and apple slice. Can't wait to test them and smell them. That's not all because we have two little blind bags. So one is a blind basket, one is a mystery villa. This is a squinky dew drop and a Shopkin season two. Ooh, I love those. Boop. Let's get to it, you guys. How about we color up our ponies, smell some markers, lip balms, and open up these surprises. Let's do this. Start out with the pop out friends. I love these. And it couldn't get any better because Pinkie Pie is in there. She's one of my faves. I actually found this at the Dollar Tree for a dollar, so this will be cool. Let's get our color in on. Get our four pack of crayons. I may even use those smelly markers. We get purple, pink, yellow, and blue. Let's pop out pinky. These are super easy. Whoop! Just came right out. And it also comes with a base, so they could stand up on their own. There's one, two, and Twilight Sparkle. Here's all the pieces. Let's stand them up. They have this little hook here. It goes right into the base part. And boom. <laughs> they are cute little decorations. These are even cute to put on like a birthday table if you're having an MLP birthday party. They're just kind of like these 3D cutouts. Really, really pretty. Here's those four little crayons. Ooh, they're super cute. They have Rainbow Dash and Little Applejack. All pictures of the ponies on there. But instead of just using crayons, how about we mix it with the little markers on there too to make them super colorful. Let's open these. Here's our crazy faces. <laughs> what a funny name. They really do have these crazy faces. These are by Crazy Art. And there's eight different colors and eight different scents. because I just pop these out of the box and I can smell these babies already. I haven't even opened them and the smell is so, so strong. It smells like a fruit salad. Here's the first one up. It is red. Ooh, I thought it would be cherry, but it's actually one-eye watermelon. <laughs> Look at this guy. He really looks crazy. Give it a little smell. Mm. Oh, wow, so strong. I cannot believe how much it smells like watermelon. This is kind of like smelling lip balms. Ooh, look at this one, Chuck O Chip. <laughs> this must smell like chocolate, chocolate chips. Whoa! <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys, you have to smell this. It smells like a chocolate cake that just came out of the oven. Unbelievable. I cannot believe a marker can smell so yummy. Next one is Ozzy Orange. Ooh, look at that one, he's winking. Give it a little smelly here. Ooh, it's an orange color. Ooh, really citrusy. Smells like orange juice or lemonade. It's a good one too. How about this? This is probably, yep. <laughs> of course it's gonna be grape, goofy grape flavored. He looks really goofy. <laughs> Look at that smile. <sighs> the grape is so, so strong, you guys. I think after the chocolate chip, this is the best. It's just super strong. It smells like grape juice. Ooh, I love that one. Fourth one is Blueberry. Babylon Blueberry, ooh, <laughs> look at his tongue. Mmm, <sighs> smells like a blueberry slushy or snow cone. This one, ooh, it's banana. <laughs> I thought it would be lemon, but banana is so much cooler, and I guess his name is Benny. <sighs> this one's not so strong. Probably the lightest scent of all of them. I can't smell anything. Doesn't smell like a marker. It just smells like really nothing. <laughs> kind of like water. No scent at all. Bummer. Two more. Sour apple. Ooh, look at this guy. <laughs> He's got a little cracked tooth. Ah, oh, 
that one's really good. It smells like a sour apple blue pop or Jolly Rancher. And the final one, I thought it was actually bubblegum, but it's berry, Mary Berry. Ooh, oh, this one's really good. This one smells like candy. It's really sweet. It doesn't smell like berries. It smells like bubblegum or candy. These were Here's great. the whole wacky marker gang together. Ooh, they look so pretty standing up with all these rainbow colors. What do you say we put these guys to work and start coloring? Let's start with Miss Pinkie Pie. I think I'm gonna go with pink for her body and for her bright pink hair. I'm gonna go with this Mary Berry marker. So Miss Pinky's little body here is with the light pink. I'm just going to take this Babylon Blueberry and outline her pretty blue eyes. Ah, I could smell this all day and I'm using the Mary Berry Pink for her pink fluffy mane. And Pinky doesn't just look fantastic and all pink, she smells like uh, candy. Oops, I just kept my marker and put her little stand on. Here is our first little pony pop out. But we do miss Twilight Sparkle. And for Twilight, I'm going to use a little bit of crayon and marker, just like the Pinkie Pie one. Let's fill in her little cutie mark first with the berry marker. I'm just going to take a little of this goofy grape and outline her pretty purple eye. Boop. And that one little pink stripey she has in her bang, I'll do that with the marker. Do a little lighter purple. And the darker. There they are! Twilight and Pinky, our two little pony pop-outs. I think they came out perfect. I'll keep these two little cuties for the rest of the video. And now it is lip balm time. Look at these. They're actually little keychains and fruit slices. These have to be the cutest little fruit ones I've ever seen. The whole little apple slice. And a juicy orange. Ooh. Look at these little fruity lip balms. They look like little slices. They are adorable. I think I'm liking the apple one a little bit better. Wonder how this opens. Hmm. Oh, so, so adorable. That's so convenient. Just pops right off. The Jude, look at all of the lip balm in this thing. It is filled to the bottom. It's super heavy. You are going to have apple lip balm forever. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, it 
smells so, so good. It's got this creamy kind of clear color. It actually does look like the inside of a real apple and it smells so, so good. Kind of smells like applesauce. I'm just loving this cute little container. I've never seen one like this. Just clips right on. You could hang it from your keychain. Love that one. And we have a little orange to go with it. This is really cute too. This looks a little more realistic. Oop, my hands are so slippery. Ooh, got it. Just flipped across the whole table, knocked over all the markers, but it's back. Ooh, look at this color. It is so shiny. I have to tell you guys, this feels exactly like Vaseline. It's so, so moisturizing. Oh, this smells so good. I think the orange even smells a little better than the apple. It's really, really citrusy. Ah, oh, smells really good. Kind of smells exactly like this little orange pen or marker. And this one is also jam-packed with lip balm. It is filled. <laughs> this is probably equivalent to the size of like five or six lip balm sticks. There is so much in here. Ah, oh, feels so good on my lips. These two are the cutest. Now we're on to the blind bags. We have a little squinky dew drop, mystery villa. This is probably the second one I'm opening of these and they are adorable. They have two little squinkies and a hairdo. And we also have Shopkey season two. I love season two. Let's open this one first. I love these throwbacks. I'm loving season five, but season two and one were probably my favorites. See, two little blind bags. Here's the first one. Ooh, what is this? <gasps> Ooh, I have this one and I love it. I will take a duplicate any day. We have little Cherry Churro. And Cherry Churro is from the season two sweet treats. Ooh, look at that yummy churro with the chocolate on there. Yummy. And for the second, we got, who is this? Ooh, <gasps> I know this one. It is Ice Cream Dream. I think it's another sweet treat. Here they are, two classic season twos, little ice cream dream, the chocolate one, and cherry churro. I like them both. All the last little surprise of the show, and it's a goodie, squinky dew drops. These are really cool. They're kind of strange. They're these little squinkies with little hairdos or wigs. And I love these cute little mystery villas they live in. This kind of looks like a cupcake. Oh, this definitely is a cupcake. It's got all these little sparkles and sprinkles. Here's our collector's guide. And these flying bags are really cool because they're all attached. It's like this big, long, white one. Here we go. Hoping for a cute one. Oh, look at this little birdie. I'm actually a little confused. This is either like a birdie or a baby seal. <laughs> I'm not too sure. I'm gonna look at my handy dandy little collector's list and see. Could be either one. That could either be a tail or some little flippers. Well, found it. Okay, so from the Arctic Island, we have Celia Flippers. Oh, those were little pink flippers. She's a little seal, not a birdie. Now we get to find her little hairdo. I think it's the one in the middle. Oh, look how cute. It's like a little explorer cap. These are super funny too because the dudes actually have their own name. <laughs> Sometimes they look like hair, sometimes they're little hats. This one is, ooh, it is called an explorer dude. It's kinda like a little safari hat. And on the back of each one of the squinkies, there's this little hole. All you have to do is put it together like a puzzle. And they're good to go. Oh, she looks so, so adorable now. Ooh, I feel like an explorer now, huh? For our third little squinky we get, ooh, I hope it's a good one. Look at this. Looks like a little dolphin. Ooh, this one's also from the Arctic Island and it goes by the name of Nora Whirl. I'm thinking this is a little dolphin, but I'm not too sure. It's got a little beak. <laughs> it kind of looks like a mix between a dolphin or a penguin. If you guys know, I would love for you to leave me a comment. And little Nora can wear the hat too, although I think it looks a little better on Celia. They're both super cute. And when you're done playing, you can cover them up in their little villa. 
There it is, guys, another fun one. We did a little coloring with these scented markers, our little pop-outs, and some lip balm, Shopkin, squinky doos so many cute, cute things. And we're gonna have so many more fun videos coming up on the show. This is Bubble Pop Kid. You can click this big red subscribe button here and subscribe to our channel. Have a great day, bye.